Hey, Damn Noodle here. This is the first review for the channel. This is a cool little set. It's age 7 and up, and it's about $20 in the US. Obviously, if you live in the UK, I don't know. But, uh, yeah, this is around 300 pieces, and this is a 3-in-1 set, and I like it. Uh, I like it. It's supposed to be like an F1 kind of car, going super speeds or on the track. I think this is supposed to be like a little head kind of thing. Like a helmet kind of thing, as if there's a person in the car, maybe, I don't know. Got a spoiler on the back. I don't know as I like it. Same as this. This is red and yellow. The other one is blue and cyan. And this is the first time I ever actually got to get these wheels, also. Yeah, same model, just different color. But I like them, though. They're pretty neat. And finally, the truck. This is the... The main truck, oh, uh, also I'm going to be reviewing uh, all three of the sets, or all three of the variations. There's the first one, the main one, but uh, this is the first time I actually got these also. 2x2 two two with a, a slice through the middle or so. But I think this is good. Good set. Six wheels up. Oh yeah, also has a trailer hitch obviously. Lights on the back. Uh, no lights on the front, but it does have like a pretty cool looking grill thing. Grill. You know, windshield and everything. I do really like the build though, it does look really neat. It even has like the slight slant on the, you know, here. Has the, the horns also. It, it does look a bit janky here, it kind of just cuts here like that. I don't like that. It has nice, really big lights. It has the exhaust, obviously. Nothing really to see on the back. There's also this, which is for detail, I think. Well, yeah. Fuel tanks, I think? Yeah, that's pretty much where they put them. Uh, there are some gaps, like here, and a couple inside the build when you're building it. So you're kind of having to build over nothing. But, uh, I like this, though. One of the issues is it is very front wanting to be here. It is very front heavy. And the trailer that holds the cars, yeah. Goes in the back of the truck, obviously. Has a trailer hitch? I don't know. Trailer knob, I guess. I don't know. But the, the cars get up. Alright, okay. Anyways, the actual trailer. There's stop lights on the back, like there should be. There's even caution lights on the sides. Some all wheels. I do kind of like these curves also. There's uh, this for, yeah, we need to stop. This is at like a slightly weird kind of height though, the the stop, because the, the front wheels are a bit floaty. Can't really see, but they are kind of hovering in the air a bit. But I like this. So this is the vehicles getting on. Nice, nice, nice. Uh, the front one really fits in well with this, kind of like locks in almost. Well, I mean with this also, but like the, the front, I really like that. It really just fits into place nicely. And in the back car, the red one. Doesn't fit quite as nicely because this isn't at the right level, it's just one, one above. Yeah, all fits nicely though besides that. And it's good to go. One issue that I don't really like about this is uh, when you do put this on, Ooh, what do you do? Ugh. Okay, cars. Go away. When you do put this on, like right here, it's fine, but then you take it off and that happens, so you have to uh, do this. Because this is barely attached to the trailer at all. Like the slightest bit. Yeah. Whip says that. I like this. On to the next build. This is the second build, or third. I don't know exactly. But this is, uh, the boat, yeah. It's a small cargo ship kind of thing. I don't know exactly what this is for. Or excavation. I don't know, something like that. But you can see one in a half decks kind of thing. I think this is probably another deck, I don't know. But, uh, it does feature some curves, obviously. And, you know, for the side of the hull and the bow... And it is uh, only one one plate higher, so it's pretty much flush to the bottom. There's only like a tiny bit that you can see that's white under, 
you know, this. This is supposed to be like the top portion that's out of the water. Uh, also, you can easily take these off for, I don't know, if you want to do anything. That's not really like a feature or anything, but uh, you can see the windows are actually slanted forward like they should be. I don't know exactly what these are, but uh, they exist. I don't know what this is either. That could be a lifeboat that's black, but uh, yeah, I don't know. Uh, you can see like the deck even goes forward. This is obviously, you know, like a slope, but uh, just imagine it's not because again, like this is mini scale. This is about six, seven and a half wide, something like that. Well, I mean, I'm not really looking at it really much, but uh, yeah. This cool though. It does feature like a crane for uh, lifting some sort of thing. Uh, oh, wait, no. Maybe this is a lifeboat. Maybe that's why it's yellow. But it's kind of weird how it's like a massive crane just for one thing. But it, it, I'm pretty sure this is supposed to be like an exploration kind of thing. Reminds me a bit of the the blue 2015 or 16 exploration set that I have, actually. That has, you know, the little hole or something, a hole on the back of the ship. It's a very small boat, pretty much. But uh, yeah, that's, that's it. You can even like lights up there. There's like a slight slope for, you know, like the sun to not murder you. I do like how they did try making this a uh, good angled, or not angled, but you know, like, slope, trying to go to the middle. Uh, the one bad thing, or a good thing, depending on how you look at it, is this. So many parts. This is just the set, obviously. Uh, obviously it doesn't feature any of the wheels, because it's a ship. Massive plate here. Obviously, for some people this is good, for some it's bad, because, you know, you might want, like, extra pieces. And some people just won't like it because it's too much of a waste, but, uh, obviously, it, it is just, like, mostly wheels and that. But there are quite a lot of pieces, like, uh, this plate and this, but I still like it, though. And this is the third one. Uh, this one, for some reason, at least for me, is probably my favorite, just because, I don't know, I... I don't know, I just like to focus on uh, one vehicle more than multiple and like, you know, semi truck and a trailer. And the boat was kind of eh. But uh, this is a six wheel vehicle for construction or destruction or whatever. And it has a crane. You can see it has uh, the, the main cab here, obviously, with the uh, black, has uh, windows, has a uh, little cabin here also, so you can control the crane. As six wheels, don't really think I have to, you know, say that, but you know, whatever. Uh, some nice lights, you know. I do kind of like this right here, it doesn't look bad, but also this is pushed back a bit. So this kind of just one entire, uh, brick outwards, so it kind of just looks weird. But, uh, the wind, uh, the mirror is kind of special, I haven't really seen any, anything like that ever. That's definitely interesting, how the mirrors were made. The sideways and whatever piece that is. Anyways, that's the back. You can even see, uh, I guess the exhaust. I guess. I don't know. Specifically out of this crane and nothing else. But yeah, that's... Oof, a lot of, a lot of exhaust. A lot of fumes. Sadly, you can kind of see this. Just holes. Just, yeah. But you know, obviously, it's very constrained and it's hard to make these, I can imagine. Especially, like, the, the creator ones. Three builds. Oof. I just have lights here. And this does have like a little huggy hole, or I don't know something, you know, to put the crane down. Ooh, to put the crane down, so you know it's good when you're traveling and stuff. Obviously, this is some sort of package. How this works. You can go in here, and it's very snug. Uh, the one thing I gotta kind of complain about is the fact that this is so unbelievably loose. Not just like left and right, obviously, because that's not really bad. Uh, the issue is the fact that this is. Slightly above, so it can easily move back and forth and side to side and kind of wiggle a bit more than it should be able to. Yeah, it's not like it slides out like too easily or anything. It is still like a, a click to get out and in, but it is just a bit loose. I do like the look of it though. I do like, you know, the look of this and everything. And, uh, well, the crane's good. I like this in general. It's good. I like this. It's probably my favorite build. I don't know why. I just... Maybe just because this... Hmm. Uh, well, the semi-truck was good. 
Just just the semi truck, yeah, no. I mean, F1 cars and everything, that's cool, but I mean, I don't know, just, I just... Big vehicles and literally nothing else, at least to me, I just, I really like... Big vehicles, just in general. But, uh, yeah. That's, that's pretty much it for this one. There's, again, like, more gappy stuff in there, but I mean, it's... You don't notice it too much, probably, and it's kinda a thing that happens, maybe? I don't know. Also, at least they made all this smooth, I like this kind of like slope downwards. I do like that. That's that. The third build. Anyway, so that's the end of this vid. Hopefully, you guys liked it. Uh, this is the the first review for the channel, but I mean that's also just because I just got the set today, actually. And uh, I don't know, testing my chances, trying to really trying a lot of things on YouTube. Also, I shrug and have a lot of Tourette's and stuff, so obviously. You'll see me kind of wiggling around and also everything. This isn't the first face reveal, but uh, I don't know. If there's anyone still watching now, that would be cool. But uh, yeah, anyways, thanks for watching. Uh, don't forget to leave a thumbs up and uh, subscribe, because that would be great. Make content. Not every day. <laughs> I mean, at, at least like once a week. I mean, I, I say at least once a week. I've been uploading a bit more. This one I probably should up upload like very quickly. So a whole bunch of mumbo jumbo not many people care about. But uh, yeah, I'm, I'm, I'm just trying. Anyways, don't forget to thumbs up, which is like, subscribe, uh, maybe even check out my other channels. I have about like 10 to 20 vids, 10 to 20 other vids. And uh, yeah, also this might be a bit yellow white in the background, but my phone is not great. Anyways. Bye, see ya.